my friends, I'm Kathleen, and today we are going to do some vocal warm-ups and exercises that will help our transition from head voice into chest voice and back. We often refer to this as our mixed register or our mixed range or mixed voice. That being said, if you go to three different vocal coaches, they may very well have three different ways to talk to you about this mixed voice. Why, you may ask? Well, put simply, we are teaching something that is generally led by sensation. Some people love the scientific explanations and some would much rather learn by metaphor. I try to introduce a combination of all of the above. For our purposes today, we are looking for a freely produced resonant sound that has a seamless transition between our lighter register or our head voice and our heavy register or our chest voice. While there is most definitely science around which muscles are used where, which muscles are dominant or in charge, as well as the manner in which our vocal folds come together, ultimately we are looking for a sensation of freedom and a sensation of ease and a pleasing acoustic that does not have a dramatic shift between chest voice and head voice. Unless, of course, you're using that for musical or dramatic yodeling type of effect, but that is not what this particular lesson is about. Please take a moment, as always, to align yourself, focus on the task at hand, and take a couple of low, natural, deliberate breaths. Starting now on a lip trill or a bubble, let's sing the following pattern. through that octave. a lip trill into an E sound, we will sing the following pattern. With no break in between. Your goal is to bring that same feeling we had in the lip trill, but now move it to an E sound. We're looking for focus and efficiency over resonance right now. on an NG sound like hmm. Try it. Hmm. Now let's sing on that on this pattern.
that same NG sound. Once again, looking for no breaks. Well done. Moving now to a neigh sound on this pattern. Neigh. These focused sounds will add stability to this mixed middle voice. like this. Gee, 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 gee. This G sound is going to give us a nice floating neutral larynx and a focused E sound. Here we go. into the voice and also being mindful allowing our head voice to unfold into a heavier register as we descend. You can exaggerate this a bit as we go. will give us practice negotiating coordination in our mid-range, two notes at a time. We'll sing on DO. Please note the breathing pattern. It sounds like this. Do, 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 do. Try it.
following pattern on knee. As we ascend, you can think of lightening up on the ascending interval within each exercise. of that E into the O sound. exercise will help us bring consistency through our middle range. We will sing the following pattern. <laughs> Work on steady airflow and a relaxed jaw that doesn't overextend. explore the range. singing with me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss a thing. Let me know in the comments below which of these exercises were your favorites and I will see you next time. Okay, okay, but I'm wearing a black shirt. <laughs>